Welcome to MBC News. This is latest news for you in a move that could signal an impending shift in the special counsel investigation being conducted by Robert Mueller, former National Security Advisor Michael Flynn's legal team has formally cut ties with lawyers around President Donald Trump and his family. Citing four people involved in the case, the New York Times first reported the development Thursday. Mueller is the special counsel leading a probe into Russian interference in the 2016 presidential election. Legal experts say defense teams will often share information and materials they have in common while advocating for separate clients until no longer willing or able under the law to do so. Jay Sekulow, a member of Trump's legal team, said Thursday that no one should draw the conclusion that this means anything about General Flynn cooperating against the describe the change in communications as no surprise. What was not entirely unexpected was that Flynn may be discussing a plea with special counsel, Sekulow added. Dot Flynn, a retired Army lieutenant general who Trump fired as national security advisor for misleading the vice president about his communication with Russia's ambassador, has been said to be under scrutiny and Mueller's attorney declined to comment Thursday. Because this matter involves the private defense of the president, White House special counsel Ty Cobb had no comment. Sources familiar with the investigation have told NBC News that federal investigators have gathered enough evidence to bring charges against Flynn and his son. NBC News reported earlier this month that investigators were examining more information surrounding Flynn's lobbying work, including whether he laundered money or lied to federal agents about his overseas contacts, according to three sources familiar with the repeated a point he has made before that Flynn's security clearance was first granted under the Obama. Obama administration fired Flynn in 2014 from his position as head of the Defense Intelligence Agency largely because of mismanagement and temperament issues. Mueller's probe has so far resulted in the indictments of former Trump campaign chair Paul Manafort and his deputy, Rick Gates, on money laundering and other charges. They have pleaded not guilty. The indictments center on their lobbying work before Manafort joined the Trump campaign. Former Trump campaign adviser George Papadopoulos has also pleaded guilty to lying to federal agents about his contacts with Kremlin-connected Russians.